Ruby Safari. In this video, we are going to make a quiz on Scratch. Don't forget to open Scratch. So to start, there will be a cat face circle with a plus. Press on that. Now this is what the screen you will get. Choose, choose someone. Choose something from it. There is all animals, people, fantasy, dance, music, sports, food, fashion, letters. There's everything here. Okay, so I'm gonna choose some some people like um I choose let's let's choose Jordan. Oh no, let's choose fairy. Fairy is much better. So this is very. I'm gonna make her go to zero zero. Well, x zero y zero. Okay, remember x is size and y is up and down. Okay, now let's see her costumes. She's not smiling now. Let's see if there's a costume of her smiling. Yeah, this is one. No, this is not. Sorry, is it exit? Not this also. Not this also. I think this is only better. Very. Okay, now on her code, go to events and there's when flags click the first right. Take that over in the code space. Then go to looks, scroll down, and then you'll find show and hide. So take the show and put it below when flags click. Now go to events, I mean control, and take this one. When wait one second and make it 0 0.5. Now in controls only, there is repeat until block. Take that. Now in sensing, the light blue circle over there, there is ask block. So take ask and put it here. So I'll I'll ask who am I? Now here in this repeat until this silly kind of shape here, not silly like a shape is over there after repeat until. So to fill that you have to go to operators. And here there is the same shape one but just extended saying there is a blank and equal and then 50. Remove that and then over here go to sensing and there is answer there. Put this answer over here. Now over here there is 50. Over there put fairy. Fairy. Look, this is how it is working. Who am I? You have to answer. Fairy, but but there's still one problem. If you answer something else like girl, it just asks something like that. You have to make her say something. So to make her say something, if we get the answer wrong or correct. We're going to go to control again and over there there is if then else block. Put that below who am I inside repeat until. Now take out this green shape, this shape thing with answer equal fairy. Duplicate it and add it over here. Now add this again there. Now, now here we have to put, go to controls again. And wait one second, both the places, and then stay, go to looks and say good, and in else place. Now this is what happening. If we put fairy, it says good and stops. Now in the else place, takes takes say again. And put it on top and put try again. Try uh, again. 
Now, if we get it wrong, this is what happens. I put one, two, three to see. Try again and comes back again. That's how it is. So you got the first way to do it. Now, take wait one second again and put it below over here. Before doing that, remove remove from this wait until place and duplicate it and put it over here. Now put this back here and the wait one second and this. Now it's time for another question. I'll put uh, like 5 plus 5. Here the answer will be 10. 10. And let's make this 2. We didn't put an exclamation mark first. So we'll make it with an exclamation mark. And let this be like this. Now this is what will happen. Who am I? Fairly good. 5 plus 5. 10. Good. It's like that. Now you will you now you should duplicate it with wait one second and put it below so it should work properly. Like you don't have to take it from one second from here again. It will like happen. You can just duplicate it and then make other ask questions, ask other questions kind of which username am I on like that things like that or like Math questions or nature questions or any questions you want. And it will work. I have left the project link below in the description. I added more questions and changed some of them too. Bye. See you in another video.